If you want to be able to buy the most expensive players and open the best packs in FC24, go to u7buy.com to buy your EA FC24 coins. It's cheaper than buying FC points and just as reliable. With their already amazing prices, you can get an extra 6% using promo code INCEPTION at checkout. Hey guys, what's going on? Inception here and welcome to another video. Ladies and gentlemen, today we have the new flashback Renato Sanchez to check out. Um, in this year's game, he wasn't like super crazy as he was in the, in the past, right? Like in the past, honestly, if you use his rare gold card, you were chilling, bro. That card lasted such a long time for a crazy amount of time, like just in a general sense, right? So I'm curious to see how this card performs. I hope they gave him at least a regular intercept. Intercept is, in my opinion, such an important play style. Okay, good. Okay, so five foot nine, high, high work rates, four star, four star controlled right footed player. So uh, the main ways to use this card is going to be in two different ways. One is going to be as your stay back while attacking player or the card that is your box to box that could potentially push forward, right? You can use them in either way. Uh, you can also, not going to lie to you guys, potentially use them as a right back, right? Because this card does have very good pace stats with very good defensive stats so if you wanted to rotate him into that area which you could because he has like the center mid and right mid position changes then you could do that as well also right mid for like a three back wouldn't be bad either but the main things that we have to test out this card is obviously what he's like on the attack and the defense because he has long ball pass jockey plus and technical so that really like shouts at you and says I like being used as the attacking oriented center mid or as the box to box center mid or anything like that, right? So um, very curious to see how this card performs in game. The play styles are very interesting. Relentless as well as a very, very good play style to work with. In game attributes, it's a very clear and obvious uh, shadow chemistry style for this card, right? So on the shadow chemistry style, you will be increasing the pace as well as the defensive capabilities. Um, mainly in like the slide tackle, you're gonna be boosting that part of the card quite a bit. Um, but yeah, Shadow gives him perfect pace, very good defensive stats, and he's just like a well-rounded player, right, for, for the for the most part. So yeah, we'll go ahead and unlock him and um, use him in the midfield position, and uh, we'll see how he plays, man. Hopefully he's a beast. Oh, I thought Renato was still going to go in there. That's how I made the cross. Beautiful pass there. Gotta pass it back there. There you go. And so through ball downwards. A good lot pass too. Good shot cancel. The shot cancel allowed me to uh, dribble quickly there. Had a good first touch as well to kind of trap the ball in place and go from there. Nicely done, Renato. Position there. This is how the visitors start the game. Yeah, it looks to be a false nine with a three up front, but sorry, two stands here. Oh, it's good that he kind of stayed on side there. Let's go. Did I score in time? Did I score in time? What a rat. Did I score in time? Oh my goodness, bro. 
oh, I gotta get the first touch and then shoot on the green and la la la. Maybe a green on a first touch would have been good, but it's just hard to tell if I would have had the, the time and stuff there, you know? Good switch. Oh, EA, you're just, you're something, man. Goes through my legs, of course. And he gets to that, what a beast. Little dribbles there, a lookman to uh, Ronaldo Sanchez. Let's go, dude. Let's go. First touch there was nice to open up that space. No, I was a little bit far off for that to work out. Oh, oh, dude, there's no way. Did, did uh, I don't get that? Was that like a header? I swear he went with his leg there. Guy just missed. I was like, brother, if you just like shoot this ball like normally here, you're cooking, my boy. That's what I wanted. Small cross, touch. And maybe a penalty. No penalty. Oh, almost. And too close to the goalkeeper. Yeah, I kind of figured it was too close. Thank you. No, dude. It was so good as well. Good tracking, Renato. I seen that. Oh, give me that. No. Shield it off, lay the ball off there, switch it back to him here. Beauty. Good play. Good play, good play. Oh, dude, that would have been a really good play if I actually got that off in time. Good play. There we go. That is what we're looking for. And crossbar again, because I didn't green it, man. I didn't green it. Nah, uh, you got the long ball. He's got the long ball. Okay, yeah, you and your animations. Ronaldo did well there, though.
it's almost like that where it's like, you know what, maybe I do want a little bit of extra pace, you know? That's it. But we score anyways with my boy Luckman. That's the attacking AI stuff, right? Like you want him to get into those positions quickly. Please, thank you. That was a good ball. Good ball. Hit him with the long ball. There it is. Oh, should have just kept it going forward there. There it is. Get that power shot off, my boy. Well done. Well done. Ooh, Renato. Oh, a good ball, too. Oh, unlucky, man. That was sick. That works out. The pass off, too, yeah. Touch. Takes him a while, but we got there eventually. Sure. First touch on him, eh? Works out nicely. Ronaldo does a good pass there, too. I'd rather do a law pass than a through pass because he does have the play style, right? So, oh. Ooh, goalkeeper saves that one. Oh, I got a lot pass. Oh, unlucky. Good build up, though. Good stuff. Couldn't just shoot right away or else I would have been cooked. Now he still got it. Nice pass again. Oh, don't forget the ball. And time the Trivello there properly. Well done, well done. Keep it going. All position there. Good touch. There it is. Good play. Good play. Small little lob pass. be mine but it won't be no 
Another penalty there. This time with Ronaldo Sanchez. Is he going to leave? He left on the tie. Yeah, that makes sense. Nice try, nice try. Oh, Lookman. A little finish right there. Oh my goodness, I didn't green it there. Good play, though. Oh, the pass is there. It just doesn't go through the guys. Oh, I tried. I tried. First two are good stuff. Okay, guys. So final verdict on the new flashback Renato Sanchez card. So people are freaking out because they're like, oh, this card is like really cheap, blah, blah, blah. I'm going to be honest with you guys, I think they fairly priced him as an SPC. I think 378k, 350-ish. It's the ballpark for, in my opinion, how he operates in-game. Like, it's just a pretty solid midfielder for the most part, right? Um, with this card, I was using him mostly in, like, the midfield situation where, you know, he could potentially attack for me, he can defend for me, right? Um, he definitely has to be played as that like box to box type player right so for instance if i'm playing a 4-1-2-1-2 and he's one of two center mids okay if he's being played um in that 4-3-3 formation that i showed you guys recently and he's being played as the cam in the team where he could potentially push forward then that's how he's going to be played 4-3-2-1 honestly for a card like this if you kept him in a 4-3-2-1 and you kept him on stay back while attacking cover center in that center mid position that would be fine, but then you can also use them as the attacking oriented card to score opportunities that way as well. And that would be cool too, right? Like we were actually able to get some attacking opportunities with the card because of the presence that he had in game for, you know, how he generally performs. So for me, I think the price of the SBC at 378, 350 is incredibly fair. I don't think they really overpriced him on, nor do I think that they're giving you like a super cheap SBC. I think 380K for how he operates in game is perfectly fine. He's, he's definitely a really nice card uh, to work with. The only thing that you have to be mindful of, but let's be honest, most of the cards are like this, is the fact that his average or normal body type on the left stick specifically um, is a little bit weird. So you definitely have to utilize a lot of the technical plus as well as the L1 dribbling uh, to kind of utilize a card in that sense. But again, very important for them to give him the intercept playstyle, even if it's just the regular, it just makes these cards a little bit more well-rounded when it comes to actually defending and being well-positioned in the pitch um, in that midfield area, right? So yeah, I, th I think they fairly priced him as an SBC. It's a cool SBC to get that will perform really nice in the meta of the gameplay, 100%. So yeah, hopefully you guys enjoy this video today. I will catch you guys for the next one. Peace out, dudes. Love you guys.